Hello, I'm Avanish Kumar and I'm 12 years old. If there's anything I can't live without, it would be my dad. He's the most magnificent and magical person in my life. He's my biggest supporter and most astounding source of inspiration. My dad works hard all day. He's also a very nice person. He helps me whenever I need it and gives me advice on how to be a better person. He taught me that I can do anything I put my mind to and that there's no shortcut to success. So you have to work hard to achieve your dream. He also told me that positivity is key to greatness. When I was five years old, I wasn't able to ride my bike without training wheels. But my dad helped me, and then I was able to ride my bike with tra without training wheels. When I was eight years old, I went to Elitch's. It was fun, just that I couldn't go on any of the tall rides because of my fear of heights. My dad went on, but my dad went on all the tall rides with me, showing me that it isn't scary, and that made me lose my fear of heights. When I was in fourth grade, my dad helped me in my science project, which I got first place in. When I was in fifth grade, my mom and sister had, got, had gone to India because of a family emergency, and only my dad and I were here. My father, the man who had never cooked just more than an omelet, cooked three full course meals for me after he came from work. <laughs> in the morning, he cooked breakfast and lunch for me before I was even awake. He cooked chicken for me every Friday. He still does. He took care of me. He ironed my uniform for me, for me to wear in the morning. We lived without my mom and sister for about three months, and he handled it very well. There was this one day where there was a blizzard outside, and I was sick, and I accidentally threw up on him. He didn't. He had to take another shower at two in the middle of the night, but he was understanding. So he just took care of me until I felt good again. Another day, I had a high fever, so he had to take a day off from work to take care of me. He also, my dad also put me in Taekwondo. He put me in it because he said, a healthy mind can only be in a healthy body. At first, I didn't like it, but now I do, and I've been doing it for about a year now. My dad puts me in literally anything I ask him to put me in. And because of that, I've done swimming, basketball, soccer, uh, a robotics club, and dance. Well, dance wasn't my idea, it was the, my dad's. He <laughs> said I should go to it because I had stage fright. And after dancing up on the stage a few times, I don't have stage for it anymore. I'm always confident when I get up on the stage. My dad says to study, but to enjoy life as well. And to do that, we go to the movies or an amusement park every month. We also just go to parks as well. And I'm actually going to the movies tomorrow. Uh, okay. The best thing my dad did for me is when he put me in eye level. I level helped me a lot. Before I level, my grades were great, but after I level, my grades became amazing. It helped me in my writing skills and math. My dad just cares about me more than anything. So to summarize it up, I would say my whole life revolves around my dad. And I, he's my role model, and I want to become a hardworking and successful life, successful man like him. He's also my lifeline, and that's why it has the best dad in the whole universe, why I can't live without him.